Psilostazole, decreases coronary artery, stenosis in diabetic patients. Psilostazole, an antiplatelet agent, has shown advantageous effects on the progression or development of atherosclerosis. In some previous studies, psilostazole, along with other antiplatelet agents was found effective in patients who had coronary artery disease. The aim of the study was to compare the efficacy of psilostazole with aspirin in patients with diabetes and subclinical coronary atherosclerosis. Patients between the age of 30 to 80 years with type 2 diabetes along with presence of one or more cardiovascular risk factor and had 10 to 75 percent coronary artery stenosis were included in the study. Patients who had typical anginal chest pain, signs of ischemia on ECG, uncontrolled hypertension, acute bleeding, severe kidney or liver dysfunction or taking any other antiplatelet agents were excluded from the study. The prospective single center randomized open blind endpoint study included 100 diabetic patients who were randomly divided into two equal groups psilostazole group and aspirin group. The change in coronary artery stenosis was evaluated after 12 months of treatment. The change in plague composition, cardiac markers and coronary artery calcium score were also assessed. After the treatment, the coronary artery stenosis was decreased in the psilostazole group and increased in the aspirin group. After the treatment, the non-calcified portion of plague was decreased in the psilostazole group while increased in the aspirin group. The result of the study concluded that 12 months of treatment with psilostazole is effective in reducing coronary artery stenosis and the non-calcified plague component in diabetic patients. Therefore, psilostazole is an effective treatment option for preventing the progression of coronary atherosclerosis in diabetic patients.